In this video, I'll show you exactly how you can eliminate render blocking resources from your website. So let's start. When you open up PageSpeed Insights, just enter your website's URL and then click on Analyze. Wait for the results to load. And now you shall see a recommendation as you scroll down. Eliminate render blocking resources. Just by eliminating them, you can save about 1.45 seconds, which matters a lot. So how do you eliminate render blocking resources in WordPress? This is what I'll show you right now. So head over to your website's dashboard and then install a plugin. Just head over to plugins, add new. If you do not know how you can install WordPress plugins, then refer to this video shown on screen. This is my video in which I have taught how you can install WordPress plugins in two ways. I'll also link to it in the description. Now search for the plugin WP Optimize. Now just install this WordPress plugin. And lastly, activate it. Next, go to settings. Now we'll configure its minify settings. Dismiss this message. Now disable trackbacks. Don't do anything to the comments. Now click on save settings. Now WP Optimize is an all-in-one plugin which will help you in your database, with your images, with your cache and with your minifying. I use this plugin on my website explorersoffun.com for the minification and the speed optimization purposes. Now this is the database cleanup and now we'll head over to the minify settings. Now click on enable minify. From this, uh, click Process HTML, JavaScript and CSS. And then lastly, click on Reset the Minified Files. Now, we have minified all the files and with this, all those render blocking resources shall also be eliminated. Now, wait a few minutes before you test this with Google PageSpeed Insights. It takes a few minutes for Google to fresh a new copy of your page. Now, let us test our website with the Google PageSpeed Insights. Just head over to this, remove your URL, type it again, and then press Analyze. Now, let us see the desktop section. Scroll down and here you can see the render blocking resources which were at 1.45 seconds have been reduced to 0.18 seconds. Now you can't remove these two render blocking resources because these are necessary for the functioning of the plugin. Therefore you shall always get 0.18 to 0.1 seconds of render blocking resources. Although that doesn't matter a lot, we have reduced it. We have reduced over 1.4 seconds of render blocking resources. Now you shall see your website even loading fast. So this was the first method. Now let us shift to method number two, and it is using the auto optimize plugin. So let us delete this plugin from our website. and delete. Now head over to add new.
and then search for auto optimize and install this plugin and activate Now head over to its settings and then click on optimize javascript, optimize css and optimize html. Now don't enable these three options and these three options in js. Lastly in the extra select Combine and load fonts, remove emojis and remove query strings. Save these changes. In the JS, CSS and HTML. Optimize. Optimize. And optimize. And then click on save changes and empty cache. Now. Let us test this website again. Press analyze and wait for the results to load. Here you can see we have fixed the render blocking resources. Although auto optimize shall add some of its own CSS which is, which is necessary for its working. Therefore we can't remove this. Although we are now only left with 0.4 seconds of render blocking resources. So I would suggest using the first method as it removes more than what optimi auto optimize shall do. That is what I use on explorersoffun.com. This was all I had for today. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to this channel by clicking the subscribe button just below this video or by clicking on the watermark in the bottom right corner. Also, head over to explorersoffun.com and sign up for the newsletter if you want exclusive tips on WordPress, blogging and SEO. Thanks for watching.